Hello everybody, Pulisink back again with the Raid Shadow Legends and this is a fusion update on my progress, how many fragments I've collected so far, the, the tournaments that currently are live or have just started, we're going to take a quick look at that and uh, have some fun doing it. So guys the gleeful is the current, in case nobody's aware or you haven't really been paying that much attention. Guys the Gleeful is a bomb champion who actually makes bombs very scary. Uh, if you check out his kit, if he dies, he detonates all bombs. Which means if you place him with other people that put bombs on, you can bomb the hell out of your opponent. And we currently sit on 75 fragments. So let's check tournaments. I believe we have champion training, uh, which should be relatively easy. Even though I have done zero of that so far, it should be relatively easy. Now, Dragon Tournament, we currently have uh, Super Raids. I think that's what it's called. Uh, for Dragon, so... And it's interesting how my bracket is not that busy. Four and a half thousand points is... It's pretty insane actually, so it's so, so low for dragon, it's actually unbelievable, but we have the four fragments that cost us 2,250 points, we're getting two items at once, it's great, it's just two piles of points for one run, the champion training tournament goes to 5,150 points, that I will be doing very soon. Get some champions, level them up, make your ones to level 10, make them two stars. I get two stars to 20. Level them up. The ones that you made two star, put a Brunum, get them past level 10. Get the extra little experience points or tournament points, then make them three stars. So, fourth, get your 30s. The three star chickens go to like level 12 or so, then you make them your 30 is four star. You're going to rack up a crazy amount of points quick. Arsenic Coup, that's a funny name. And so far I have 16 points and I'm not even sure what the hell I've done. Classic arena takedowns are relatively easy. They normally don't cause too much of an issue. And let's just take a look at the events. I believe it's just Dungeon Divers, Spider, oh. has potentially just finished, Spider was not that bad, I don't necessarily mind Spider, if you have a pretty quick team, so Artifact Enhancement will be easy enough, although I spent fucking millions, keeping in mind I, I built up Jareg, which I will maybe do a video on soon, but it's 1685 for the Dungeon Divers event. So we're, that should be relatively easy. We can get five more fragments for the fusion, and the artifact enhancement should be quite easy. Let's just double check. Is it 10 from the champion training? That is worth a look. It is over 5,000 points, so potentially we can go for that. So let's see how it goes. Let's quickly have a look. Come on, load up, stop being so laggy. So, no, five fragments. Five is still okay, it's not the highest level of points. Would have been nice to get a sweet 10 thrown in there. Help everybody get to that finish line a little bit quicker. But that's pretty much where we sit, and you've maybe seen stop throwing deals in my face. Fuck off. Gaius the Gleeful, that's what I'm looking for. You know, Gaius, I hate when we have a fusion, and he's not at the top if it's an active fusion. So currently, 75 fragments. I will get the Dungeon Divers done, 80. Uh, we have Artifact Enhancement, Arena, Champion Training, 
that's like 90, 95 points. Depending on Dragon, I might make a push tomorrow and potentially see if I can win that tournament. Closing out this event, I had 70,000. The Artifact Enhancement is such a pain. I had so much silver. Uh, now I've got a hell of a lot lower, so I need to actually keep a little bit of silver. Try to build up a stock again, because it disappears way too fast. So that's where I'm at with the fusion. How are you guys getting on? Are you enjoying it? Are you participating? Are you sitting this one out? Let me know in the comment section down below. You're up in full of sync. Stay safe. Keep on reading. And I'll see you guys soon.